Hi, it's Jamie, Progressive's Employee of the Month, two months in a row. Leave a message at the... Hi, Jamie. It's me, Jamie. I just had a new idea for our song about the Name Your Price tool. So when it's like, tell us what you want to pay, hey, 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 and the trombone goes, blah, 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 and you say, we'll help you find coverage options to fit your budget. Then we just all do finger snaps while a choir goes, savings coming at ya, savings coming at ya. Yes? No? Maybe? Anyway, see your practice tonight. I got new lyrics for the rap break. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company and Affiliates. Price and coverage match limited by state law. This is No BS Job Search Advice Radio, episode 1027. I'm Jeff Alpin, the Big Game Hunter. I'm your host for this show, as I have been for all those other episodes that precede this one. And this is an optimistic one. It's Monday, you know, and I'm talking about how to give notice. I hope some of you have that experience this week. By the way, uh, I'm going to detour for a second before talking about the show. I have a class on Skillshare. There's a link in the show notes for how you can become a member of Skillshare. Two months free premium membership uh, if you use the link below. And one of my classes is about resigning. I'm sorry, no, it's actually about starting your new job. The first 90 days, three different courses, uh, three different uh, videos that talk about how to get rolling in your first 90 days. So again, use the link in the show notes. Now, back to what I was about to say. How can you resign without too much fuss is the topic of this show. And you know, your firm may go, but why? We love you. You're so important to us. Please stay. Don't go. We need you. And, you know, in this kind of economy, that happens much more regularly. So that's what this show is about. Hope you find it helpful. If you have a question for me, connect with me on LinkedIn at linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. Once we're connected, I'll answer your questions. I can't answer them all in a given day because uh, I do get a lot. Uh, and I, se- I select individual ones to highlight for shows. So again, linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. Short questions, please. Not big, long ones that I have to charge you for. And again, Skillshare. Use the link in the show notes. Notes. And now let's get going. Now, here's the question I received. And I've received a lot today, but this is the one I chose to be to answer. After being headhunted two months ago, I now have have an offer on the table I can't refuse. I haven't changed jobs for seven years now. How can I resign without too much fuss? Well, there are two parts to this. The first part relates to your boss. Now, all you have to do is request 15 minutes with them. Most people resign on a Friday. The however is, if for some reason you have to start sooner than two weeks from that Friday, resign now. You say, can I get a few minutes with you? Great. And you have word processed a letter of resignation. The letter says something to the effect of, uh, this is to confirm what I've told you orally, that I'm resigning my position with, fill in the name of the firm, effective immediately, and providing you with two weeks' notice. My last day of employment is such and such. Are you fill in that date. New paragraph, thank you so much for the opportunity I've had here for the last seven years. I really appreciate it. However, I have a great new offer that I'm looking forward to. Best, best of luck to you, and if there's anything I can do within these two weeks to assist with the transition, please let me know. Very truly yours, and you sign it. Hand it to your boss as you, you sit down, and then orally say much the same thing to he or she. What you're doing is handing them a confirmation now. Now, you can't guarantee their response. After all, and this is the other side of the equation. You know, I said there are two sides to this. Well, the first side I dealt with was your side, which is what to do. And given that you've been there for seven years, you may not have changed jobs often. I suspect on your side, you'll have a degree of of a churning stomach beforehand. This is very common. On their side, your boss may hear these words and their eyes may become big and they may start going, I'm going to illustrate it here for you. 
but why? We love you. Words to this effect. You're so important to us. Please stay. Oh my God. What's it going to take? What's it going to take? So you can't control their side of it. On your employer's side, on your boss's side, for seven years, you've been the reliable, loyal individual. And now you're leaving. So they may try and persuade you to stay by paying you more. You know, if money was the only reason why you wanted to change jobs, pay attention. But you need to remember the other reasons, too. Usually firms make promises to departing employees to persuade them to stay. But remember this. Number one is, in two weeks, they're going to forget what those promises were. Trust me. And number two is, if your boss leaves, who knows what these promises were, right? And suddenly, and I'll give you an example I remember from years ago, this person who was doing 80% travel, who wanted to stay close to home, uh, was willing to do 25% travel, and decided to stay when his firm promised him that, and his boss promised him that. Well, his boss quit, a new manager comes on board, and lo and behold, we're up to 80% again. So you have to get that part in writing, which they're never going to do. So in terms of minimizing fuss, they're going to take a couple of runs at you to persuade you to stay. Your boss's boss may meet with you. HR may do an exit interview with you saying, oh, why did you decide to leave? And this is not the time to go out with what I call guns blazing, shooting in every direction, criticizing everyone and everything as you go along. You know, it's, it's ridiculous. They're not going to change anything. That's the reality. They're not going to change anything, and you're going to look foolish and goofy. You know, being critical of your boss, who's going to still be there, or critical of your coworkers, who are going to still be there, and are being loyal. So just politely say, happy to do the exit interview. They ask you why you're looking. You can simply say, as you, as you said in your note, uh, I've been headhunted. The job is terrific. Uh, it's very different than what I've been doing here. It's a great opportunity. I've decided to go forward, okay? So that's today's show. I hope you found it helpful. If you did, here are a few ways to engage with me. First of all, I just want to start by saying that I no longer do recruiting. I coach people to perform at a high level. So again, I no longer do recruiting. But if you visit my website, which is thebiggamehunter.us, and look at the tabs on the top, you'll see a menu of choices available to you. First of all, you can hire me to do a resume and or LinkedIn profile critique, interview preparation, help you with a salary negotiation, answer your questions about your job search, advise you about a decision you have to make about a job offer, those are all there as an option. I can do a job search makeover with you where we critique everything you've been doing in your search up until that point and come up with alternatives. If you're relatively early in your search, we can do a complete coaching program where I work with you from beginning to end in half hour increments so it doesn't have to take a lot of time for each session. You can also connect with me on LinkedIn at linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. Mention that you listen to the show because I love hearing from folks who like it and are interested in my help. Again, linkedin.com forward slash IN forward slash the big game hunter. You can take my classes on Skillshare, too, and become a premium member for 99 cents for the first few months. I have a link in the show notes. Just follow that link, sign up, take my classes. Lastly, I want to mention to you, you can find a lot of information at TheBigGameHunter.us, and at times it may seem like it's too much. So you can look at the best of my material at JobSearchCoachingHQ.com, where I've curated information that you can watch, listen to, or read to help you find work more quickly. Again, that's JobSearchCoachingHQ.com. I'll be back tomorrow with more. And in the meantime, I hope you have a great day. Take care. The Starlight Lounge presents An Evening with the Progressive Box. Oh, what a great audience. 
Let's dim the lights for this next one. Nope, too much. Ah, there it is. Gotta get things just right. Like Progressive's Name Your Price tool. Tell us what you want to pay and we help you find coverage options that fit your budget. And now, the mood is right. Wait, the lights are back on again. Trudy, can you? And now it's completely dark. Progressive Casualty Insurance Company and Affiliates. Price and coverage match limited by state law.